This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. Listen, the CFTC paid a whistleblower $1 million in a digital asset case. Now, paying whistleblowers is great because it gives them an incentive to snitch. But CFTC is not telling us what case this was. I'm going to tell you guys something, and this is just my opinion. CF, CFTC, SEC, DTCC, FINRA, these agencies only care about snitching and paying whistleblower money when the snitching stops one company from taking advantage of another company. If this whistleblowing scenario involved the CFTC protecting retail investors, pension funds, and institutions that follow the rules, they would be blasting this all over the place, letting us know that they're protecting retail investors, that they're protecting institutions that follow the rules, that they are protecting pension funds. But I believe, and this is just my opinion, that this whistleblower award that was paid, this was another company robbing, well, maybe not robbing, but taking advantage of another company. It was one big dog taking advantage of another big dog or something similar to that. When people whistleblow and the people losing money are retail investors, pension funds, and institutions that follow the rules, the SEC never follows up. They never investigate. CFTC also, FINRA, and the DTCC. They do not protect retail investors. They do not protect the market. They only protect other large entities. That is their role. Their role is to give the impression of taking care of the market. Give the impression that they're protecting retail investors. Give the impression that they care. When in reality, their real job, in my opinion, is to keep the status quo, to keep the 99% in line and keep the one percenters fear with each other. Okay, one percenters screwing over other one percenters, the CFTC, the SEC, the DOJ, the FBI will get involved. They will look for justice. But these same bad actors robbing retail investors, pension funds and institutions that follow the rules. There will be no investigations. There will be no whistleblower payoffs because they are not concerned. That is not their role. Their role is to make sure the 99% stay in their place and make sure the one percenters play fair with other one percenters. If we are losing money, nobody cares. Not the SEC, not the DOJ, not the FBI, not the CFTC. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that this $1 million whistleblower payment was made to somebody who was snitching on a big actor robbing retail investors? Or do you think this was a big actor engaging in questionable activity with another big actor? Anyway, have a great day. God bless and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.